Tonight, a canine deputy in Tangipaho is recovering after a suspect shot her. Yeah, this happened Saturday near the St. Tammany line. News News Fallon Brown tells us what happened, where that suspect is now, and how the injured dog is doing. Bella, the four-year-old German Shepherd, took a bullet to the lower left jaw. But fortunately, she survived, and she's doing better tonight. Saturday was a rough day on the job for Bella, a four-year-old canine unit with the Tangipaho Sheriff's Office. As Bella went to engage uh, the suspect, she was shot in the lower jaw. Uh, did not strike any bone or, or, or any teeth. Uh, soft tissue damage. It all began with a phone call from a concerned citizen about two people walking around a trailer park off of CC Road carrying guns. Deputies responded and immediately made contact with the two suspects that fit the identification of the complaint call. As deputies approached and attempted to speak with him, both, both, both subjects. Uh, they started resisting. As an officer dealt with one suspect, the other started to walk away. A Tangipaho K-9 deputy released Bella in an attempt to stop that suspect. As one of the officers was dealing with one suspect, the other suspect started walking away. As our K-9 deputy attempted to stop that subject, she released the dog and the subject produced a firearm and started Shooting the uh, shooting at the dog, which one of the bullets hit the dog. Another deputy returned gunfire, and the two subjects ran into the woods before barricading themselves inside of a camper nearby, where one of their mothers lived. And basically, the the older lady in the house walked to the front door, stepped out, and says, "Hey, can y'all just come back in the morning?" And she went back into the home. Wasn't long after that we deployed gas. Our SRT team deployed gas into the camper trailer and within seconds they came out surrendered peacefully. Now all three are in jail facing multiple charges including harm of a police animal. But Bella was just doing what all canine units are trained to do. Another dog Thor was there to demonstrate. Nine! Thor! Nine! Six stitches later she's on the road to recovery. She's on uh, pain pills as well as antibiotics. Uh, it's just one day at a time, but she seems to be recovering well, doing a lot better than we would be doing in the same situation. In the meantime, she's getting lots of love and belly rubs. She seems to be happy to be here today, Definitely. and we're happy to have her here. A bond was set for all three suspects today. The two men on a bond of $325,000. The woman on a bond of 300000 Michael.